Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to WrestleMania. We got a we got a weird match coming your way here, Astra. How weird is weird? Weird as in we've had this building for quite some time. Ever since we saw Kane come back and we said, why in the world is Kane back? Ever since we found out that the town hall of Knox County burnt to the ground and Kane went missing. Ever since we found out that gold glitter was found at the site. And now we've found out what has actually happened here. Kane pieced it together before any of us. Kane and knew. Kane knew. Kane knew as soon as he got a little hint of it. Gold dust burnt down the town hall. I, uh, I don't have words right now. Why he did it, who really knows, but it seems like he really wanted Kane back, and Kane said, no, I have to focus on my mayoral, on my mayoral, mayor duties. Ma mayoral? Mayoral ma duties. Ma mayor and Goldust yeah. didn't take no. So here he is right now. This is Kane furious that Goldust killed all of his staff, all of his friends, possibly his family, who even knows. And Goldust is now fighting for survival, potentially to keep his job. Who knows? But either way, when this comes down to it, Goldust has to pay for what he's done. So you say all of that. All of that. Goldos is the one that's attacked Kane with the baseball bat to start this match off. Probably because he knows this is do or die right now for him. If Goldos does not win this match... Appears to be a false Count Anywhere match. False Count Anywhere match. So this could take us anywhere in the arena tonight, ladies and gentlemen. So I don't know what we're going to get. Who knows? As Goldust throws Kane into the stairs here. But I'm disgusted by the action of the SmackDown general manager. I'm just disgusted in general as... I don't know if either of these men have any excuses for the way they've behaved over the past couple of weeks. Of course, are, are you saying that Kane getting caught in a fire once more, losing his job, losing friends and family because Goldust wanted him to come back and wrestle again, rush in leg sweep, is not justifiable? I love that little little in between you just did there, but I. Yes and no, but I'm just saying in general, him attacking Cesaro and Shelton Benjamin. Essentially, that was just, they just got caught in his path. Man is very frustrated. When you I see, will, uh, when you see Kane, you, you, you give him a clear berth, especially in this attire, especially in this day and age, when you know what's happened to him, you stay away. And they unfortunately, they just got caught in the wrong place at the wrong time. And right now, Goldust is paying for his actions rightfully so as we're potentially getting a power bomb on top of those steel steps Astro. I th this match has just blown me away we started this this show off with what seemed to have been a bloodbath but I think this one truly is going to be a bloodbath and Kane will not rest until no. he's done with Goldust and maybe to the extreme level We've of done with the Goldust. disgusting and the vile things that Kane has done in the past here, and I, I can only imagine that we're going to have another example of that here tonight, or today, since it's still daytime. It's, uh, we must have started at noon. I don't even so know. I, th I, think it was, I think it was shortly after noon that the show kicked off. Yeah, so I mean, so. whatever. And Kane coming out of the daytime... Who thought this, that's almost who like thought, Undertaker coming out of in was, like the daytime was a my, good idea. My question is, was this match ever truly on the card, or is this just happening? I don't actually know, Asher. We got the referee out here. It wasn't announced. It wasn't talked about. I don't even know how this happened. I'm going to be honest here. I, I, I have no idea. I don't know if Goldust made the match. He does have the power to make it, but why would he make this match for himself? I'm not sure. Kane tearing apart that announce table over there, though, is Goldust given the opportunity now to rest and get back to his feet and Kane just looking Gold. for absolute destruction Goldust got the sledgehammer but Kane unable to find anything below catching Goldust with the stiff right after he missed with that clothesline there that was a savage strike as now picking him up for that side box slam right on top of the monitors ouch very much very much ouch as now Kane is taking uh, taking his anger out on Goldust and oh dear Beautiful clothesline from Goldust here, turning around with the sledgehammer now to the chest. But as you said earlier, Goldust came down with that baseball bat. He has had a fair bit of the offense in this match here so far. I'm honestly a little bit surprised by that. Big uppercut from Kane here, taking Goldust down to one knee. Big kick to the gut. What's he going for here? Pick him up there in a powerbomb position. Let's see, he's bringing him over the table, probably just 
Getting him situated. Oh, another disgusting power bomb on the table. Right on the corner of that table, too. Can you imagine that? Right going right into the center of your back. I imagine it, and it seems like it sucks. It definitely does. Uh, throwing Goldust over now into the corner. This match has yet to have gone into the ring. No, these, it has these not. These men started the fight on the ramp. Uh, and at I, this point, I they've think, just... They've I think just, Goldust might just... Was Goldust just that? I think he might have gotten hit so hard that he might have had, started having a seizure there, Astra. I am not entirely but sure. He's, he's right back to it, just like that. Right back into it, and a savage clothesline from Kane. Of course, like... Still tearing apart this table. He, Kane is going to put Goldust through one of those tables if it's the last thing that he does here tonight, Astra. Today, it's still... I, I'm used to doing shows in the nighttime. This is throwing me off. It's okay. We'll make sure we talk to them about the next WrestleMania. It does not go right outside. Now. It does not go outside. Inside WrestleMania, keep everything controlled, climate controlled, keep the, you know, the wrestlers cool so they can perform at their peak. Yeah, absolutely, as we seem to be going for final oh. call, I believe that's called. Goldust going for a signature move. I know that much as now he's taunting Kane. Not a wise decision. Not a wise decision for you, Goldust. As now he's bringing back Kane back to that table that he's cleared up here. Let's see what he's able to do here. As he picks up a sledgehammer. Chooses not to. Thinks twice about it. Instead has decided that he's going to put Kane through the table. What has he got here? Going for that signature Goldust EDT. Well, Kane cleared off both tables, and he was the first one to go through said tables. I'm sure that's not the way that he imagined it here. That... But Goldust. Oh. oh. Go ahead, sorry. No, no, just I was going to say Goldust still maintaining all of the offense, but Kane getting up like it was nothing. Getting up like it was nothing, and then slamming Goldust right through the barricade. Make sure now that the, the fans are not hurt. Get some security down there so no one decides to run in and interfere. That's one thing that I don't actually see. Any security on the, anywhere near any of this. Like, they should be right on top of that. Immediately make sure that the fans are back out of the action here. More or less keeping Goldust and Kane away from them. Absolutely. As we, This is the craziest thing that we've seen yet. As it's Like I said, it's not even stepped foot inside the ring yet. And now both men still... Moving on to the next portion of the arena that they can destroy, because we've already lost another announce table. Ringside is destroyed. They destroyed the barricade, and now let's see what Kane even wants to do here now. I don't even know. Who who knows what's in his mind as he starts thought of it taking up towards the entrance ramp. Instead, going for a nice little scoop slam onto the stairs. It looks like he's trying to take this uh, away from... The main arena here, though. No, Goldust reversing, throwing oh. Kane up the ramp himself. Baseball bat back on the ramp there from the entranceway. Goldust pretty smart. Taking that baseball bat right to the lower back of Kane. Of course, if he can't lift you up, he can't hit you with that choke slam or that tombstone pile driver. That is true. Now Goldust being the one taking the initiative, sending Kane back towards the backstage area, still with a baseball bat in hand. Oh, the production crew, we need to talk to him. The cameramen are not really paying attention to what they're supposed to be doing here. No, unacceptable shots 100% here. As we can't even see what's happening, we can only assume that Goldust is still beating on Kane real bad. Taking him, throwing him over right next to the pyro here. You gotta be careful if someone accidentally has a little bit of an itchy trigger finger. Don't, well, want, to, don't want to see Kane's pyro go off. I feel like we had uh, Undertaker take care of them, so... I'm not too worried about that as we get a choke slam here up on the apron way or the ramp, sorry. Beautiful move here from Kane now taking back his uh, his authority in the match, if you will. Oh my Goldust, why did you let this match happen? I, that's that's really the only thing that I'm stuck on that I don't understand. I'm right there with Plastic. It's, it's, it's not good for either party as, you know, how could this situation end? Oh, Goldust... It, Goldust just ran backstage. I'm sorry to cut you off there. No, it's okay. As we got a beautiful shot of the referee. He's looking good here. Even he's just, even he has himself done up for WrestleMania. Absolutely. And now both these men right back at it. Now back in gorilla position. Which is a term I probably shouldn't throw out there, but I'm going to do it anyway. Throwing Kane into that table. Let's see. We hopefully we got people. Yeah. Hopefully nobody is backstage here right now because that's a, that's also a big concern you got to think about. Yeah. Both these men totally unhinged. You never know what could possibly happen. They, you, 
someone could get seriously hurt back here. But the referee, thankfully, is still right there. This is a sanctioned match. I don't know if it should be. Probably shouldn't be as... as I feel like... Stone Kane into those trunks. Yes, he does. He's trying to do something here. Not quite He's sure. to take out his shin, I think. Not quite sure what's going on in this. Col Goldust is uh, taking his own way, trying to get down the hallway here. No, running big boot from Kane. See, Goldust's not going to get away that easily. But no, nope. I, I, I can't even fathom. It, it doesn't make a lot of sense for Goldust. It seems like he ran away to backstage, and when they were got ba backstage, he's running back towards catering in the interview area and stuff like that. But why is he running so far? He's had the opportunity in the upper hand in these matches here, Astra. He most certainly has. There has been a fair bit of back and forth, but as you said, Goldust has been in charge for the majority of it. Beautiful punch to the forehead, unfortunately. Running wave right there. Kane has that mask, though, so that punch is not going to do a whole lot. Not so much. Oh, we had a clothesline and a running knee from Kane. Big boot. Big whips. More like it. the kidneys. Now throwing him over into the electric... Electronics into the breaker box. Panel breaker, breaker box. box. There you go. That's the word I'm looking for. Yeah. Not doing anything really. Just throwing him into it. That's all he's doing. Which is fine. I mean, it still hurts. It's still hurting him. He's trying again to do something. He's just trying to hurt that shoulder because that is, of course, the choke slam hand for uh, for Kane. That it is. But Kane taking these chops and not going down to his knees. Goldust getting. A little bit frustrated with something here. You got to do something. Quick jab to the chin, going for a scoop slam. Not gonna happen. Nope. Kane is a little bit too heavy for that one. As looked for, he's like he was going for a power bomb. Reversed by Goldust though, flipping him over the shoulders. Now we got to watch out here. We got somebody up in the interview area. They should probably get out of there. I, I don't know what Goldust is trying to do here. It looks like he's just talking smack to Kane. They're trying to. I, I honestly I'm at a loss for words this, this match is move backstage and I don't know where it's gonna go from here it's wherever Goldust wants this match of course false count anywhere for anybody who's just tuning in <laughs> on still absolute savagery from both the, parties that here. breaker box alone Goldust I mean maybe he's trying to break yeah. that's that's the breaker box for the whole arena there Astra if he takes that out then there's no lights there's no power that's still, it. Still chair in hand, and yes, no, you're absolutely right. Renee, your interview host was gone. You need to run, Renee. Nope, can't get to his feet. Catching that chair from Goldust, throwing it away. Oh! Oh, vicious elbow from Goldust, big reversal. We got the parking lot attendee in the back there. Both men are busted open right now, I believe. We were looking for security. There he goes. There he goes. He's, he's running away. He wants nothing to do with this. I can't blame him for running. If I was back there right now, I would also be screaming. Yeah, I, I wouldn't be anywhere near these two. I don't want it. Kane standing on the ladder, which is on top of Goldust's face. All that weight coming down on him. I, I can't believe this match is still going. Goldust, all you need to do, if this is truly a false count anywhere match, all you need to do is pin him and He's then just, run away. There have only been a handful of pinfall attempts here so far. Goldust grabbing that fire extinguisher. And those, both both those pinfalls actually were at the beginning of the match when yeah, Goldust so far, was just trying to get it over. This. Yeah. So I don't know what is going on here, but now it's almost like they're going into the parking area, but Kane's setting him up on the table for something. Don't even know. And it looks like he's setting up for a power bomb here. Shades at his brother. Yeah. Vicious jackknife power bomb through the table. Oh dear. Goldust has to be out of it, and I, might I add, actually, Goldust looking good. He looking like he's in good shape. He's I was, in good shape. I was nervous under that suit. I mean, just because he's the general manager doesn't mean that he's going to let himself go like that. Oh, Goldust tried to run into the parking area, but got caught in the back of the head by that steel chair. And Kane says, you want to go in there? Fine. We'll go Let's in go. there. Signature uh, fire extinguisher just there in the middle of that uh, that floor we of course saw Kane attacking Goldust with that fire extinguisher not long ago a couple we weeks did. back on Smackdown and here we go Kane just still just tossing Goldust into this area here we got an ambulance there we got a transport truck with a trailer with a few faces that we haven't really seen but for some reason they're still on the truck I don't know they're being advertised it's fine there's a limo Goldust quickly running back getting on top of the limo there Trying to hide away from Kane. Not quite, uh... Oh, he's going for something here on top of the car. 
Is he going? Looks like he's going for a oh power bomb dear. of his own. Oh dear! No. Oh no! Oh no! Oh to no. the concrete! Oh my God! Kane folded in half, and then diving with a body press with the splash sword on top of Kane. That attendance, those two attendants in there have a fantastic show to a potential murder. Let's be honest here. I at the rate it's going, I'm pretty sure that that is exactly how the, this match is going to end. A disgusting power bomb just then. Can't, oh no! 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 Goldust, get out of there! Look at the blood on Goldust's face on the knuckles of Kane. It's absolutely devastating. Oh, Kane just sat up. He took a vicious power bomb off of, off the, off the limo there to the ground. A press chair shots, all of it. And now Goldust running away, trying to get to his best of a hiding spot as he can into the top of the transport truck. That Probably, seems like the most logical place yeah, to go. Yeah, you got to see here right now that everything he's putting at Kane isn't working. Kane thinking, trying to figure out, does he want to go up there with him? Yeah. Very slowly, though. He's a bigger man, a little bit less agile than Goldust. He's also taken quite the beating tonight. That he has, but I mean, both of these men have, and now Goldust just waiting on top of that transport trailer right there. Right hands, kick to the gut. Oh, no. Oh, no. Goldust, no. Not again. Not from that height. Oh, my God. As Kane is nearly folded in half with the impact on the ground. I thought the limo was a high fall. But that's off of a transport truck trailer. That's that's ridiculous here. And Kane is still He's saying no. Uh, he, he, I am seriously thinking that Kane may not be human. He might not be human, and he's certainly not in this to win it. He wants... I, I actually think he wants to end Goldust's career. It's starting to seem that way as... Goldust has... Yeah taken quite the beating since but Kane again he's been thrown off a vehicle he's been battered since the beginning of this match and just in general I don't understand how he's still moving I have no idea Astro and at this point here he's just throwing him into whatever he wants there, there has to come a point where somebody should think about stopping this match here what someone needs to step in Someone absolutely needs to step in before one of these two men ends up dying in this arena tonight. Goldust right there hitting a pretty vicious move on Kane, but still opting not to go for the pin. I think at this point the, the relevance of winning the match has all but left the building. Goldust now, his face is completely coated in red, just a crimson mask. Can't even see his face paint anymore. It's no. just blood. It's almost, it looks pretty good red and black though, I'll be honest. It really does. It's yeah. a good look for him. You should try that. Uh, you should try that for, for for the future. Yeah, maybe we'll see what happens there. Well, if there is a future, we'll have to find out. Because look what's going on here. Kane still getting back to his feet, still fighting. Right back. hook from Kane, throwing him now back again over towards the vehicles. Like, is he is he going to try something with the car there? Is he going to try to do something with the ambulance? Who knows with Kane there? This is. Uh, this, this this is too much at this point. This isn't a wrestling match. This is just a beating. This is absolutely too far on both parties, as far as I'm concerned. Sure, Goldust wanted to, you know, have the oh, big no, red no, machine. No. no. On his roster. No. Car you door want, to the shoulder. You want the big red machine, and you got the big red machine. Unfortunately for Goldust, he went about it in the incorrect way. Of course, um... I'm just actually just getting word uh, from a production manager that the police are actually in the building right now looking for Goldust. I mean, they know exactly where he is. They just need to come to the parking area, but I don't know if Kane is going to want to see that, I'm going to be honest, as we get a beautiful choke slam from Kane. Oh my god, Goldust. There has to come a point where you, you give up, you stop, you just... This has to stop. Another choke slam. Oh, another reversal from Goldust here as now he picks up Kane and slams him down. Yeah, and he's, he still hasn't quit. Goldust still keeps fighting. Kane keeps getting to his feet. There's just, there's just no quit to Kane in this situation. Neither man is giving up. And ultimately, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing here. I don't know what happens if Kane wins this, and we potentially lose our general manager, but I mean the police are looking for him anyway. I believe we lose our general manager no matter what, as as 
Goldust is up for some pretty significant charges as of right now. That he is, but Kane just catching him with a quick kick, getting him up for the sidewalk slam. Dropping him down. It's, it's, again, it's it's not looking good here. Somebody got to end this. Wait, wait. No. 